Meyer customers check your credit or debit card statements. New tonight, the retailer once again dealing with card processing problems. They say that Chase Bank is the one responsible. In fact, just a few weeks ago, you might remember shoppers who use their credit cards or their debit cards at Meyer stores were overcharged because of the same issue. Megan Woods joins us now live. And Megan, you spoke to a customer who was impacted by this. I did, Rod and Sandra. It's insane to think about what these customers could be facing. I talked to one customer who was upset and frustrated. He said he went to Meyer and only spent about $34 yesterday. Well, today he looks at his bank statements and he sees he was charged that same amount a dozen times. All I know is I'm 350 in a hole. Bob Pelusiak says Friday he stopped into his local Meyer and picked up a few items. Here's his receipt. The total came out to $33.86. But when he looked at his checking account the next day, he was in the negative. And I go, oh my God, what happened? And uh, I was charged of uh, 3386 12 times. He printed out his account statement and there it was, a charge from Meyer over and over again. His credit union says they may be able to do something about it Monday, but that doesn't help Bob right now. He says he's already on a fixed income while also driving for Grubhub. It took all my, uh, let's say, spending money for the weekend uh, gas uh, and other items and uh, tomorrow's my day off. I wanted to do something. Meyer is putting the blame on Chase Bank. In a statement, the retailer says Chase Bank continues to have stability issues with the payment processing systems it uses to service many retailers. Unfortunately, Meyer is one of those affected retailers and we are frustrated by the customer experience these issues have created for our shoppers. Chase assures us they are working to correct the issues, and we apologize to our customers for the inconvenience this has caused. We did reach out to Chase Bank to see if other retailers are involved or to get a better idea of how many people could be impacted by this. Now, as for Bob, he says that he's hoping Meyer or the credit union can get him that money back before his bills are due later this week. Sandra Roth, 